Hello and welcome to DrupalDude.com. Today I'm going to go over a uh, third party module that is called Poor Man's Cron. Essentially what it will do is it will run cron jobs for you automatically. Okay, so now what's a cron job? Drupal and most any other content management system out there, what they need is they need to have tasks run on a scheduled time. You submit an article and you want that thing to be posted tomorrow at six o'clock somehow Drupal has to do something at six o'clock and that's what's called a cron job it's a task so every 15 minutes or every specified period of time what Drupal will do is it will make sure that every all are all the postings up that are supposed to be up are they down that are supposed to be down is uh, is there any new content do I need to index it and make it searchable so that's basically what a cron job is. It's a Unix thing. Um, there's, you know, like Mac OS X has cron jobs that run on at certain times. Most major hosting companies, anybody that runs Apache, will have cron jobs. And depending on what plan you have with your hosting company, you might be able to access those cron jobs and you might not. Well, wonder if you can't access those cron jobs. Or, like what I had is, I didn't know exactly how to get them to work properly. Then what do you do? Well, there's this third-party module that I mentioned in the beginning called Poor Man's Cron. It's free. Download it from Drupal Download it from Drupal.org. I will actually have a link to it on uh, on my website, so you can actually, if you just uh, follow the show notes there, there will be a link to it where you can download it. Once you get it installed, and to install it, all you need to do is is put it in your sites folder. All. And then in there you should have created a modules folder for third-party modules. You do not want to put this into the modules folder on Drupal. Um, I do have an older, earlier post on this. All modules should go into, all third-party modules should go in their own folder. And where this folder is, is in the modules folder. Here, let me just, here you can see it. It's modules, all sites. Anyway, I have a link to that on the show notes too to, to see, you know, where these modules get installed. So I have it installed there. Now what I have to do is I have to turn it on. So, so here, if I go to the modules page, go to the list it here, I scroll down, you'll see one that's called Poor Man's Cron. And it says here it's an internal schedule for users without a cron application. You don't have access to it, you don't know how to figure out something along that line. All you do is hit save configuration and it's all set, it's ready to go. Poor Man's Cron will automatically run the cron job on its own. And where you have some of the settings here, let's uh, go to site configuration and look at poor man's cron. Essentially by default what this will do is this will run a cron job every 60 minutes and the number of minutes to wait before a cron error before retrying, so 10 minutes, so it just so it doesn't keep trying all the time. Do you want to log successful crons? and you want to log poor man's cron progress. The way that this works, because it doesn't work like on a clock, which is how a, a cron job would work, I would say I run every 15 minutes, this one is dependent on your site. When someone accesses your site, poor man's cron will say, oh, somebody's accessing it. Have I run a cron job in the last 60 minutes? Nope, okay, let me run a cron job. So that's the trigger point. It's not a trigger point from a time standpoint. It's a trigger from some, when somebody accesses your site. And essentially it does this every time. I've used it numerous times and I, um, I really should use a cron job, but on, on some of the sites I just, it, I get lazy and it, it works really, really quite well for me. Um, just install it, turn it on, and now all your cron jobs will run automatically. And the way you can check that, as a final note, is if you go to Logs, go to Status Report, you'll see the cron was run 1 minute 34 seconds ago. As soon as I installed that cron module, that poor man's cron, it took care of everything there. So that's poor man's cron. If you're having problems with crons, just download this module, install it, turn it on, and uh, you'll be ready to go. Hope you enjoyed this, and we'll see you next time on DrupalDude.com.